Hey, yo. You know who I want to see succeed? Bronny. Bronny James. He's been through a lot, man. Just, you know, under the magnifying glass of everybody since he was a, he was a young kid. Um, at this point, this stage, he's kind of like an underdog. I love a good underdog, man. With that said, man, Bronny and Bryce, I actually hope they do, uh, they are successful. Uh, especially Bronny, man. This dude, man, you can almost see in his, see in his face that uh, he's under a lot of stress. A lot of stress, a lot of pressure to live, to live up to something that people probably want him to live up to. And I see he's working hard, he's doing his thing. Um, with the combine and stuff like that. But I feel bad for him, man. It's like everybody is kind of like on him. It's not easy to go to the NBA. It's not easy to be like the top player in your state, let alone the country or make an NBA team. So good luck to that dude, man. And uh, I'm on the record, man. Bronny, Bryce, LeBron, no. LeBron's a good player. LeBron is a very good player, but uh, he ain't no Kobe. And he's never been one of my favorite players. Never been one of my favorite players. And it's only because I don't think he lived up to his, his abilities. As good as he is, he could have been better had he had more heart, more drive, more, more toughness to him. But hey, it is what it is. I just want to go on a record and just say, man, I hope this dude does good. Hope Ronnie can succeed, make it to the league, you know, and be successful, man. So, yeah. Peace.